Right, with me I have Lucky Kakuva, coach of SKW. Lucky, you just beat Hot Spurs 3-0. Tell me, how was the game for you? Uh, obviously, the most important thing is in, in, in a league situation is three points. You know, it was not the best of games, but uh, considering the situation that we are coming from, uh, it was definite that we had to get three points. It was uh, sort of a scrappy game, but at the end, it was convincing 3-0, first three points, and then considering from the first game, every game, we are getting better. Right, now you um, tell us a bit about the goals, a very nice opening goal there by Simon Chueza and then two more by um, Panduleni in the second half. Yeah, obviously uh, Chueza's goal was, uh, you know, uh, delivered into the, into the big box. It came off and uh, it was a hell of a volley. You know, we, we brought on Kaka in the second half and obviously Kaka is technically a good, a smart player. You know, in his execution, you could see his, his quality in the box. The second one, the first one, you know, the second goal, he, he advanced from the center area, pushed the ball just beyond the box because he has got speed, accelerated and then tuck it away. Second one, what, what, what a quality ball. He round off the defender, uh, the goalkeeper on the edge of the box, round it off and then just tuck it on. You know, he's actually the man that, that changed the scope of the game for us. Right, and it's interesting, he actually came on as a sub, so um, how is it looking in your starting lineup? Is it between him and, and um, Chueza for the, for the striker's role? Yeah, obviously Kaka is quality, but the problem is, you know, he is studying at Junom, and as a result, you know, he had tests that he had to prepare. Uh, he couldn't, he could, he could actually get into training sessions. So as a result, he has to come off the bench, and we had to get preference for for players that that that, are, that we believe are fully fit. But going forward, I think Kaka is, is a perfect option for us. He's a quality player. Right, and you also had to make a few other changes in your team and bringing in your midfielder there into central defence. Um, yeah. Tell us about that. Uh, yeah, obviously, what, what happened our game against uh, Rambles is uh, Ivan Bloom, one of the central defenders, uh, was sent off. And as a result, we had to reorganize the defense, and the only player that we shot because that we saw fit to play central defense because of his height, his aggression, uh, was uh, was Elvis Tivazera. And you know, obviously, he's not a defender; he's normally a midfielder. But I think uh, going forward, it's a, it's a it's a good role for him. We we I, w I will I will go, I will consider it uh, strongly. Okay, and I think you're up to seventh position on the log now. How are you feeling about that? Yeah, obviously, you know, it's a massive improvement. As I've said, first game BA, second game away to Blue Dust, third game, you know, a game that we could have won, Rambles, a derby game also won. So realistically, we are, you know, football-wise as a team, every game we are progressing. And it can, it can only get better. I'm confident about, about our, our situation. You know, uh, a lot of young guys, but uh, slowly but surely you can see the guys are starting to adapt in the Premier League.